Hey, Grandma. Hello, Nicholas. <laughs> what are you doing, Nicholas? Well, I thought I'd share with you uh, our last order from Gold Nugget. Okay. Now, Open that box. I got. This was our my first catalog from Gold Nugget. Um, they had. I was looking for the U.S. M17 series gas masks, and they had two of them. And uh, yeah, I bought them because they're at the time that uh, Gold Nugget you guys had them the cheapest. And then um, you guys sent me this, uh, and I really liked what I saw in it, so I kept on ordering from them. Prices was good. The delivery was good. Yeah. Since 1983. Yes. I then, spent a lot of money. On yes, this you kit. have. Yes, then I. Their next catalog was this one. Um, it talks uh, a little bit about uh, Joseph and Simon. Uh, U.S. Army uh, retired colonel, and then here is their last one. Now um, I have a binder that I would always keep all these in, and whenever I'd go to gun shows and I found something that I liked and I knew that you guys had it, I would uh, really like to price check it. Because I knew that uh, you guys were a reliable source of buying surplus stuff from. And if it was cheaper in here, well, that's where I ordered it from. So what do you say we open up this last package? Ooh, I'm ready. Let's do it. Alright. I got uh, the U.S. Army style uh, type knife. <coughs> Essentially the K-Bar, except it's just black. You guys definitely packed this thing. <laughs> All right, there's the. In case we want to order the dog tags, the invoice, and your guys's uh, letter. Um, just talking about. Uh, well, all your guys' uh, accomplishments over the years that a lot of people have appreciated, including me and my grandma. Yes, we appreciate it. Very good. The, we got the old. Wow, uh, they look. Good. Yeah, the old fatigue pants like uh, Papa used to wear. They look new. Yeah, they are. And um, fortunately, the, the coat and the hat was out of stock. But then yeah. got the old telephone bag. I think these came out during the Vietnam War, but this particular one is from 1985. Ooh, looks. Yeah. Now over at the Air and Space Museum, they actually have one of those the entire phone. Very uh, impressive. These interesting gas mask bags turned into shoulder bags. I'm not sure if these were uh, done like this originally, to be honest, or if um, those are custom, customized objects or items. So, yeah, old Vietnam style one. You can definitely uh, smell the old canvas in this. <laughs> definitely, I can smell it. Woo, tinky. Yeah. Uh, uh, there's four of them. My goodness, you buy the whole store? I wish. <laughs> and then the uh, gas mask filters. Can I have a, take a look at that? No. Right. Oh, I will. I'll look at it. <laughs> <All right. laughs> oh. 1984. Yeah. Crazy oh, that thing that they've just been sitting there all those years. Now, here are... Um, do you remember Tour Duty, that mm -hmm. Vietnam show that we'd always like to watch? Uh, and they use those grenade launchers. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, this is what they actually use to carry their grenades in. And Ooh, that's uh, very impressive. <laughs> sure wouldn't give me one because I blew stuff up. <laughs> And those actually came in sets of three. And then these uh, newer style bandoliers. I think for the saw. Ah, yeah. the saw? Oh, it's a type of gun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I suppose I, I should explain. I want country down with that. 
Well, as fast as it shoots, I bet you you could. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then, yeah, what, what was those you just laid down? These? No. Oh, the, the, those were the extra ones. Oh, okay. And then uh, tent stakes. Just those old ones, remember, back at Motive Parts when they were still oh, open. Oh, yes, that's Jacob had gotten uh, it's only a third pair, Bob. Yeah. Um, spare rope for the, the tent. I'm looking in buying uh, a tent pretty soon. Then a uh, bayonet scabbard. Oh. Reproduction made in Germany. Yeah. Ooh, that sure is handy. You can go take that and hunt elk and deer. And then uh, old SWAT hats. I bet you, you could pull that off. What? <laughs> Ooh, we have to ask. <laughs> Style. See, yeah. I still got the touch. I can wear the hat. I, you know, I think you could pull it. I think you could pull it off. And then these are uh, a pistol lanyard. You, you clip it to the end of your pistol, and then you put it over your shoulder. And then oh. if you fire your weapon, and then you gotta drop it. Oh, yeah. Okay. It's, it's so you don't get. So it's so you don't lose your gun. You can see why that might be important. <laughs> and then uh, a garrison belt. And what is a garrison belt? It's a heavy duty leather belt, essentially. Very impressive. Just what I needed. Hold my pants up. <laughs> and then um, this is actually a customized sheath for the. Uh, it would fit the K bar or even this knife. Oh, yeah. Very smart. But I don't own a K bar, so. I was going to buy one, but in this order, since it was my last order, I knew that a lot of this stuff I could either only get from you guys for the cheapest or um, anywhere that I wouldn't have an idea to buy them from. And then a pair of old black combat boots. Uh, direct molded molded sole from 1984. I see everybody. You pick up on he likes the old stuff. Yeah, yeah definitely the old timer stuff. What's that? Oh, it, it's just where the tread when they originally made it. Oh. Yeah. So crazy to think that those have been sitting in a warehouse since 1984, and never been used. Now uh, these are, um... And what was that tool I did? These are, uh, bipod carriers for the M16. Late Vietnam style, because they're nylon. And you got the old boonie hat. Um, I don't think this is a Rothko. It shouldn't be. No, I think, um, there's a picture of Papa where he's wearing one of these or something. And like I wear my grandson's one in the summer to keep the sun off my face. It has a national stock number, so it's not Rothko. And it's SPO says 2014. So, yeah. I'm gonna get a new one. Yeah. <laughs> and then, got the more steaks. Same as the orange one, so I won't open them up. Oh, you're gonna remember these. I remember I got two or three pair All of those too. Tent poles. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's get all these out of the way. I wanna say there's about twelve of them. I have to check on the invoice after this. You know, I would enjoy having them doing my Christmas packages. They can really pack it. Not really so sure. Oh, these are uh, carabiners. Those old uh, clips that you use to um, repel and stuff oh, like yeah. that. These are the original US ones. They all look like they're from 1977. Uh. Can you imagine putting your keys on that? You'd never lose them. How come I can't open it? It must be a tri trick to open them. <laughs> yeah, you just press down on that. Uh, 
top part. <laughs> you want to yeah, show her Jacob? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I just love it when the younger generation shows the elderly generation how to do something. It works. Boot laces. Now these are the original style designed to go on those boots, which I have several pairs of. And I'm not sure how well you're going to be able to see these, but the old jungle boots. Um, a uh, D-ring utility strap, whatever, oh. cargo strap. Yeah. Uh, old M16 rifle sling designed to go on the lightweight rucksack. Yeah, later Vietnam style. Oh, so. very impressive. <laughs> and it's tied with the old piece of cloth. Yeah. And then has history in it. 1990 dated unissued uh, 45 pouch. Then I'll let you guess what these are. Slippers for your shoes. Pretty much. These are protective overboots ah, for the right. chemical environment. Not really of sure course. the gear on them though. What size are they? They look like alligator ones, big ones. <laughs> you go scuba diving. Yeah. And then these. Now these are uh, clearly old police batons. And they were. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Rothko actually used to make ones like these. Uh, well, theirs weren't as good as these ones. I don't know if these are original ones or not, but Rothko has since then discontinued it. And since Gold Nugget was the only place that I knew where to get these, that was my supplier. <laughs> yes. Do -do -do. And these, I have bought about 25 of them over the years. Can I break some? Yeah. A machete carrier black with the uh, built-in sharpener. Ah. Yeah. But it's not allowed to have a machete. Well, they're out of stock. Simply because he cut the trees down. <laughs> what do you think this is? It's not whiskey or tequila. Oh, <laughs> no, it's not. What lightning? No, nope. insect repellent. From the 40s. I wonder if it would kill the big old mosquitoes. Can you smell it? Now, uh, JC would know something about this oh, stuff. Yeah. Oh, we got more stuff. We, we got, got a good deal. The face shield right control. Um, there'll be another review of these coming up soon when I'm done with my body armor series. This is something that you're really going to enjoy, Grandma, in the summertime. This is a hammock. <laughs> <laughs> and what are you going to do with the hammock? Well, what I'm most sad. people do with the hammock. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> we got a wise one here. Um, it's a deluxe hammock made by Rothko, so it's mildew resistant. Uh, and when did they inches. use those in the service? You know, the military actually had a style like this, but not exactly like this. This is just reproduction. And why did we get it? Because that never happened. And trust me, you're you're probably going to use this more than me over the summertime. Yeah, you would get tied up in it, leave me out there. Well. Well, that was a lot. Yeah. Looks like that's everything. That's right, and that's a to very nice. The recipe. owners and the employees of Gold Nugget Army Surplus Store. We've really enjoyed ordering from you guys uh, over the past handful of years. Um, always enjoyed going through your catalogs, and uh, looks like uh, this is our last good order. It's been great, so. Yes, it has, and thank you, and your prices was right, and your packing is great, and everything was shipped on time, and we thank you very much for making my grandson happy over the years. 
for any of the other reviews, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, or would like to see individual reviews of these items, just let me know. Have a nice night, and good night. Here.